Yeah, it's the worst addiction there is. It's worse than heroin, gambling, ice. Meet Michael, a 30-year-old construction site worker that is addicted to the flashing lights of Melbourne. My first time was with a mate and he said, Come on mate, it'll be fun, it'll be a laugh. And it was fun. It was a laugh, but I had no idea it would take over my life. It's everywhere I go. I'll be walking down the street and I'll see one. And then I'll walk like another 500 metres and I'll see another one. It's not fair. A bloke can only be so strong. Some days I have good days. Like, I have urges to go see Su Lin or Lisa or May. But I don't go in. And I feel good. I feel proud. But it's like an itch you can never scratch. You know? You tell yourself, oh yeah, this is the last time. But you know you're lying to yourself. And these girls, they're not like normal girls. They grab your soul. And they don't ever give it back. Massage parlors. Don't do it, fellas. It's like playing a game. A game with the devil that you're 100% gonna lose. Melbourne massage parlors. Destroying one life at a time. I thought so, bitch. Okay. Yeah, yeah, bitch.